Good morning, everybody. It's Pam from Nana's Crafting Cottage. It is early. It is about 20 minutes to 7. Everybody else is still in bed. Um, we're going to be busy running errands today, so I wanted to get out here and do a page in my fall journal with you guys. Um, first of all, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for all the new subscribers. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoy my videos. Um, I didn't get to do one this last Saturday because it was my birthday on Friday. Still kind of celebrating on Saturday. And on Saturday, we found out that we are going to be grandparents again in March. Yay! So we're so excited about that. So, so excited. Um, so anyway, uh, I just kind of kicked off and just took it easy the rest of the weekend. <laughs> and so I thought I had better get out here today and do this page with you. This is a pocket page in my journal. So I need to keep things flat right here. So th this is a very wide journal. It's about three inches. And so I have a stack of my books that I use for book pages underneath it so I can do this. <laughs> So anyway, let's get started. Um, I didn't do but maybe a couple of little things to get ready for this. I just cut out a couple of little things, but I wanted to do the rest of it with you guys. So if you have anything to work on, um, go ahead or just relax and watch me play. So like I said, we had a very eventful weekend. And, um, yeah, so we're, we're totally thrilled with, with the whole thing. And they had, um, our son and daughter-in-law had set up a Zoom meeting with all of her family and all of us, which there isn't many of us, but there's several of her family, so that they could tell everybody at the same time, which I thought was really cool. So, yeah, but we had, my husband and I, especially my husband, he goes, hmm, I wonder. And then the more I got to thinking about it, I thought, you know, that's probably the case. Getting everybody together on both sides is like, couldn't be bad news. We were hoping it wasn't bad news anyway. And, uh, yeah, they have been trying, I guess, since they got married. Uh, two and a half years ago and finally yay but she's been very sick um, sick with a cold and off and on and then of course with the morning sickness and yeah so she's having a hard time of it already she's just a few months along and uh, yeah so we're looking forward to a new addition to our little family. And, uh, yeah, excited, excited, excited. Okay, look at these all distressed here. And then I just pulled out some scraps from uh, doing my fall and Christmas project for me and my sister's boxes for each other for next month. So I just pulled out some scraps from that and I thought, well, okay. I'll just go ahead and use all this and then some things that I had just made. And this is a little sticker that I would add it in based on the um the saying that I have here, which is, there is something incredibly nostalgic and significant about the annual cascade of autumn leaves. So I thought that would be very fitting. Um, put with some of the fall florals and some leaves. And I thought I would put it right here. I think that would be kind of nice. And I have a couple of mushrooms that I put together. And... This is just a piece of lace, a flower off of lacing that I had cut apart. So, let's put this 
dyed together. I got my art glitter glue, which hopefully will work okay for me this morning because I hadn't hadn't used him for a little bit. And I'm just going to make a simple page. It's not going to take very long at all. But I wanted to come out and be with you guys and visit a little bit and have some crafting time in. So let's get this over here. And then last night I went to get up from my chair and I just about fell over. I all of a sudden was hit with vertigo, which I've had it before, but I hadn't had it for quite some time. And wow, that that is not fun. <laughs> and I had a rough night trying to get through it. Trying to, you know, get up and go to the restroom, that kind of that kind of thing. And yeah, it was not fun. Not fun. So I think I'll lay these out the way I think I want them. Just kind of group it like that. What you think? And then um thought I'd put these little cute toadstools down here because they're kind of fallish too. And then put this in the center here. So very simple, very quick um, page to do in here. And this is a journal that I made last fall but never got to play in it because it wasn't long after that that I had knee surgery. So I couldn't really get in here for a month or two, which really was hard. <laughs> but um, I thought, well, it doesn't have a year or anything on it. So I thought, well, I'll just go ahead and um, use it now. Why not? So I have lots of empty pages. Let's see if I can undo the point on that. Eh, it's very sticky. Well, let's see if I can still save it. Here we go. Ta-da! And I'll do him here, like that. And I thought, yeah, we gotta, we gotta do some errands that include getting things done for my mom. She's got dementia, and she uh, lives with us, and we care for her, and. Um, She's not able to use her phone anymore. Plus, we have to change the address on her on her social security for taxes, and hadn't gotten around to it for quite a while. So, I we need to do that. So we thought we'll just bite the bullet and get both things done today. So after we get around and such, we will. Head out and run around. Not that I really feel like the running around and the driving today, but it's it's got to be done. So, yep, that's how it is. When you're a caregiver, you have no time to be sick or anything like that. So, it is what it is. Okay, I'll kind of tuck them down in there like that. I thought these came out really cute. Adorable. They're Tim Holtz um, fall embellishment. They're layers, so you, you know, you cut the different ones and you put them together. 
And they come out really cute. I used them last year too for what little bit I was able to craft. <clears throat> so what's everybody been up to? You crafting? Are you getting kids back in school? Um, making plans for Halloween? I was going to say Thanksgiving, but that's not for a little ways yet. But Halloween is next month. Hard to believe that this year is just flying by. People have even mentioned, it's like, wait a minute, I turned around, it was March, and I turned around again, and now it's September. It's really passed by quickly, some way, somehow. Okay. I just thought I'd stack these guys up. Get them put down. Use up some of the scraps that, yes, they were on my desk. Because <laughs> I've been busy doing things. So there you go. Let's see. I think I'll do like that. And I just wanted to do an easy page today. I thought, well, I'll do some mixed media and this and that, but I just don't feel feel up to it. So we'll just do something simple. Why not, right? That always works. And sometimes they come out better. You never know, right? Here we go. And I didn't want it to be a long video. Okay, there we are. I think I'll put that guy right there. Well, that's kind of pretty. Real fall. I love the fall. I love it when it's getting cooler. In fact, I'm still in my house coat. <laughs> of course, it's early. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, but... Yeah, yesterday it really cooled off, and so we were able to wear sweatshirts for at least most of the day. Oh, wait, I forgot one here. Oh, no, I don't want to forget that guy, because I want him to stand out. Let's see, how should I get him to stand out now? Yeah. I think I'll do him like that. Um... Yeah, it was nice to be able to wear a sweatshirt instead of just shorts all day and t-shirts. And but This week it's supposed to be like 70s mostly, so I was really happy to see that, some 60s. We're in northwest Oregon. We're about half an hour west of Portland, Oregon. And um, so we get cooler and we get warmer out here. Portland has the uh, river running through it, Willamette River. And um, is that Willamette? Yeah, I think. Uh, Columbian? Anyway, one of those big rivers. <laughs> I can't, I lose track of both of them. And so it keeps that city cooler um, but then warmer in the winter because of the river um, and we don't have that out here so we get colder in the winter and warmer in the summer and they stay cooler in the summer and warmer in the winter interesting right yeah we can be up to 15 degrees colder out here in the winter time it's amazing the difference and we're just like a half an hour away so um yeah pretty crazy well guys i think i got that page done yeah i really like it i really do but let me move these books here um the this is the 
journal that I made last year. I did splattering and corrugated pieces and some leaves and hawks. I tickets. I really like it. Um, and then this is a, a digital of eco dyeing. I think I got this from Louisa Heinzel, Junk Journal Art. And then all I did was coffee dye, put book pages in here. Um, this I had gotten from Your Creative Studio, I believe. And some uh, doilies. And I have done some work in here, but um, not a whole lot. And it's just been here and there. So we will be coming back to this journal again. So I just wanted to come out and share with you guys a little bit of time. Um, and I will be back on Saturday. Um, my sister has been helping me with thumbnails and her computer is in the shop right now, her new one. So she's not able to do it for me. <laughs> and I haven't taken the time or have the patience to learn to do it myself on Canva. So I, I just haven't been able to do that. So anyway, she will help me when she's back. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this page. Um, very simple page, but it kind of ushers in fall. And I will see you guys on Saturday. Have a good week. Have a restful, possibly, week. Stay healthy and stay safe. And I'll see you the next time around. Bye, guys.